All right, what is up? This is Soul Plays back from Dragon Ball's Universe 2. So today, guys, we're trying out a brand new mod. It's going to be the Super Saiyan Rage Future Trunks mod from Dragon Ball Super. The Future Trunks and Goku Black are holy fucking shit. Look at the texture on this dude. It is so vibrant, and it's like a glossiness. I don't know. It's such a weird-looking texture. I love it. This was created by my boy Psycho. I think he's new to the modding community. I don't think I've ever seen anything from him. So this is an awesome first step for the dude. Really awesome job. I saw this on the mod website and I was just like, yo, I have to install this and try it out. And this isn't the only version of him we got. We also have the Spirit Sword, his like future Super Saiyan Trunks Spirit Sword, whatever the name of this big ass monstrosity is, it looks absolutely insane and it just looks kind of ridiculous almost like bleach to a point we're like ichigo kurosaki with our big ass blade this is awesome and it glows and everything textures really on point i think whenever it's going through the little transition screen it looks a little bit weird i think it gets messed up but it's all good and dandy man psycho you did a fantastic job on this love it dude you know, just shout outs to him. I'll put all the links and everything in the description below. And we also have the Enraged Merge Zamasu Giant Form. I had to install this one as well, created by my boy Zan. Once again, check out him as well because this looks awesome. And we're just gonna fight and, you know, just do reenact the entire battle. So before we get started, guys, do me a huge favor and hit that like button. Sure to reach 15 likes on this video. Be amazing. I'd really appreciate it. Plus, shows you guys want to see more Dragon Ball Z Universe 2 content on this channel. So let's go ahead and check out the moveset. We have Burning Slash, Masinko, Dual Masinko, Max Charge, Final Flash, Full Power Energy Wave, and Spread Shot Retreat. And in this one, we have Change the Future for good reason because he's trying to change the future, man. Shining Slash, Burning Slash, Max Charge, Final Flash. Uh, we also got Super Gallic Gun and Energy Dome. Love it. Uh, really wish he had some kind of like Shining Sword Slash with this. But I don't know if that would get fucked up or anything because his sword is so big. This is crazy. Like, yo, we got to try this one out first and then we'll go into, you know, the normal match. So we're going to reenact this to the best of our ability. Let's go to the West City Ruins. And I'm just excited. I've been waiting for something, you know, just at least to this caliber through DLC or even mods and we finally got it. I think there have been a couple in the past, but this one alone looks really good, especially with the aura and everything. So we're going to see how this dude fares against Enraged Merge Zamasu. Holy shit. So we got some pretty exciting stuff coming up here uh, pretty soon throughout this week. I mean, not really this week in general, but the fact that it's only two days until spring break for me personally. Hopefully you guys are also going on spring break very soon because it's gonna be a good time. We finally get to relax, spend time with our family, uh, you know, to a certain extent. It's not gonna be like Christmas or like Thanksgiving where everybody gets off, but you know, most of the time you're gonna have more free time and everything. It's just nice to be away from school for a little bit because school is a pain in the ass. And he's so fucking large. We got this, man. My boy Super Saiyan Rage Trunks coming through. This is so cool, dude. It's like DLC. This is like legitimate DLC for the PC version. Like, I don't care what anybody says. The aura is on point, and we got our stamina broken, but that's okay. I got some flash kicks going on here. All right, let's try this. Uh, I want to try this fucking final flash if I can even use it. He used it. I'm pretty sure he used final flash in the anime in one of the episodes. Oh my god, I am gonna die. He's gonna kill me. So, uh, yeah, with Spring Break coming up, I'm really excited about South by Southwest gaming, or just South by Southwest in general. Uh, this is will be, I think, my second year going because last year was the first time going because of the Smash Bros. Melee Tournament Battle of the Five Gods where it was like, I think, $15,000 or $20,000 or maybe maybe it wasn't that much. I don't even know. It was a massive pot. Maybe it was $10,000. Maybe, I think it was $10,000. I don't know. I made it in like a trailer. I made like this little fan-made trailer thing, which it looked, to me, you know, it looked really bad. But I guess, uh, you know, a pretty good amount of you liked it that time when I did uh, you know, upload it, but that's when I was like real passionate about, you know, doing some shit with editing and trying to, you know, improve my editing skills to a certain extent, and I still want to do that, but, um, yeah, it was just a really cool experience going over there and, uh, you know, checking out the little gaming convention and everything. It was pretty cool. Uh, not a lot. It wasn't anything like PAX or even, uh, fucking, like, Evo or E3. It wasn't even near that great. It was a lot of indie games mainly for the convention area, but South by Southwest in general is just a media sort of place, and I'm fucking dead. Oh, no. We got this. We can do this. Come on. Hold on. We should... Oh, no, no, no. No. Fuck, dude. I thought I had it. Okay, we can do it with the freaking glowing sword. Look at me. This isn't what happened in the anime. I'm disgracing Dragon Ball Super. But yeah, as I was saying, um, yeah, it was just a really cool experience, and Nothing too uh, crazy in terms of like the gaming content that you see over there, 
but a lot goes on uh, with, I guess, just the behind the scenes with it because there's also like a music festival and it's just a bunch of media in general. Like we also have like film and everything. So if you guys are interested in that, uh, definitely if you live in Texas, I think it's in Austin, Texas at the uh, Austin Convention Center. Um, you know, go ahead and check it out if you're around that area. You know, maybe I could say hi, we could, you know, interact because it's fucking interaction between people at a convention center. <laughs> so yeah, hit me up sometime if you guys are over there. I think it's the 16th to the 18th is the gaming convention. So I'll probably be there Thursday, Friday, and then maybe Saturday. I don't know. I'm going to be leaving that Saturday. So just really excited for it. Uh, it's during spring break, so it works out pretty good. But we're going to go and use his spirit sword. Oh my God, it looks so cool. And we're going to try and defeat him once more with this big ass sword. I don't know if it's going to have the same radius or if it's going to be... You see, look at this. The texture gets messed up. I don't even know what happens there, but... I guess it has something to do with the glow, but we'll see what happens. Oh, shit, this looks nice. This is looking clean. My boy Trunks, he's got his pupils back and everything. He's got, ooh, okay, he's got some health going on there. Oh, shit. So, yeah, we still do a pretty decent amount of damage. Oh, shit. God damn, this is crazy. Like, this gets me so hyped for DLC pack number uh, three, which I have, nobody knows when that's going to come out. I just lost my stamina rip. Uh, yeah, potentially uh, next month or even throughout the summer. I would assume it's going to be during the summer, and he does big damage. This is ridiculous. Holy crap. Okay, I want to use something good. Come on, man. Stop doing that. What the fuck? This is BS, man. Got you. Oh, no. Wait, what is this? Oh, okay. I got him. <laughs> I, was, I had to stay quiet for a second there. But, uh, yeah, just... A lot of stuff going on. Nintendo Switch doing well so far. Uh, not seeing any scratches on my screen just yet, but hopefully, uh, you know, we can maintain that. <laughs> I'm very scared to take it even out of the dock. I haven't take that, to taken it out of the uh, dock for probably a couple of days now. It's been kind of just chilling in there because I've been actually uh, playing it on my TV and I completed the first dungeon. So far, I love it. It's really given me that Zelda feel, uh, especially with this first dungeon in I think the Zora province, sort of Lanayru pro province area. Is that what it's called? Yeah, Lanayru. Lanayru is pretty cool because it's water, and I like water. But we're going to go and use this final flash. Come on, kill him. I fucking kill him. No. Dude, he does. Oh, my God. He's so big, and he does so much damage. This was a bad idea. This is like the second mod showcase where I cannot defeat anybody. Come on, we can use it. Oh, shit. Oh, 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 oh. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We can do this, dude. We can actually do this. Holy shit. Yes! Yes! Oh my god, that was all concentration right there, just doing the combos. You probably heard the button matches. Let's freaking go, Light Sword. Yes! <laughs> just yes. Holy shit. Spirit Light Sword Trunks. It's like a spirit bomb in his sword. Awesome stuff. This is beautiful. So, once again, please check out Psycho in the description below, as well as Xan for the Enrage the Masu merge sort of fucking massive mod. These were both awesome, and it was definitely a spiritual experience going through that. <laughs> so that's going to do it for this video. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Take care.